Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Joel from Terry Chew Academy. Right now, we are going to solve this question together. For this lesson, we will be using tricks in addition method as well to solve this question. Okay, so let's jump to the question now. Okay, so we have 1 plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 5 and so on, you realize that actually your odd numbers will always have two of it, okay? But your even number only have one of it, okay? So there's actually two ways of solving this question, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you both methods, okay? So what is method one? Okay, so for method one, you realize that all you can do is to simplify the problem. And how do you simplify the problem? You will notice that only your odd numbers from 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 is being repeated. This means to say that can't I just break this up into 1 plus 2 plus 3, which is the normal thing that you are very used to. Okay, but you still need to plus your 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus 7 plus 9 which are the repeated ones okay and when you do that you will be able to solve it very very quickly as well okay because you can actually apply your Gauss method twice okay the first one should be relatively easy for you guys as well because you will get 5 pairs of 11 okay 5 pairs of 11, okay, so we can say that this is equals to 5 pairs of 11, okay, what else do I add? You'll notice that at the back, over here, I can combine this to 10, 3 plus 7, I can combine to 10 as well, and I have this 5, which I also need to add, okay, this means I just need to add 10 plus 10 plus 5, okay, so, 5 times 11, this will give you 55, okay? And then at the back, this will give you 25. All you need to do is to simply add them up, and you will get the answer, which is 80. Okay? So, this is how you were to solve it with method 1. Okay? So, for method 2, I'm going to use a different color, so that it's clearer for you to see. Okay? So for method 2, it is actually even shorter than that, okay? You will notice that actually what you can do to this equation is to group up the numbers, okay? Group up to what numbers? We want to group them up to tens, okay? How do we do that? You will notice that over here, okay? My 1 plus 9 will give you 10. My next 1 will go with my next 9 to still give you 10 as well. Okay, 2 can go with 8, will give you 10. Okay, 3 can go with 7 to give you 10. Okay, similarly, my other 3 can go with my other 7 as well to give you 10. And you'll notice that it can go all the way until 5 and 5. So you'll realize that from 1 to 9, you will have a total of 7 pairs of 10. And you still need to realize that you have to add this last 10 over here. Which means to say that you can straight away say that your sum is actually equals to 8 times of 10. And this is also very easy because you just add 1, 0 at the back and you will get the answer. And you realize that it is the same answer as method 1. Okay, so 80 is your answer. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed today's lesson. Goodbye and see you again in another lesson. If you would like to learn more from these tutorials, please smash that like and subscribe button.